In this forecast, severe weather will be possible across North Texas several times this week. The Storm Prediction Center has issued a slight risk for severe weather on Friday, and a strong cold front will cool down North Texas this weekend. All of that and more is coming right up. This is North Texas Weather Center with your latest four-minute forecast and temperatures out there this morning. We are mild out there. Many of us starting out in the low to mid-70s across the Metroplex. Temperatures by lunchtime today will warm up into the upper 80s and low 90s back out to the west and eventually by about 4 o'clock. Many of us will warm up in the mid to upper 90s and some low to mid-100s back out in central Texas. There is actually a chance for a few showers and storms today. Can't rule out maybe an isolated severe storm. It'll be pending on that cap this afternoon, but by about 5 o'clock, a few storms may develop back out to the west near Abilene and Wichita Falls. These will not last much longer than about a couple of hours, pretty much a typical summertime storm, if you would, and eventually by 7 to 8 o'clock, most of this stuff will just fizzle out. So we're not going to be really looking at much rain in the Metroplex, but back out to the west, can't rule out maybe an isolated shower or storm. All right, we do have a chance for severe weather on Friday. There is currently a slight risk of severe weather for a good portion of North Texas, primarily in northeastern North Texas and as well as DFW. Main threat is going to be damaging winds and some large to potentially very large hailstones out of a few storms. That means potentially baseball, the tennis ball sized hail is a possibility with a storm or two. Tornado threats going to remain pretty low. low weak low level shear will translate to really basically no tornado threat. So we're not going to be really looking at much of a tornado threat, but an isolated tornado can't be ruled out since these storms will likely be discreet in nature looking at the future radar on friday you can see by about four o'clock showers and storms can develop right along i-35 w and eventually by about seven o'clock these storms will kind of form into a broken line back out to the east that's, that's what is forecasted as of right now there's a potential that the cap stays strong enough that we won't really see much severe weather but that is kind of on the low end at this point because of how warm it'll be on friday temperatures are forecasted to be in the upper 90s actually on friday up into the temperatures for saturday morning it is going to almost feel chilly out there for many of us We've not seen temperatures like this in weeks. We might be in the 50s and even maybe the 40s near Childress heading into Saturday morning and eventually by the afternoon, highs topping off in the upper 70s. Can't ask for much more in mid to late May, so it's definitely going to be looking nice going into this weekend. Temperatures for tomorrow morning will start out in the low to mid 70s, so pretty similar to today, and then eventually the afternoon temperatures are slightly warmer than today. We'll see temperatures in the afternoon in the upper 90s and low to mid 100s back out to the west, which stuff falls 105 degrees this afternoon. Take a look at your latest North Texas Weather Center seven-day forecast. Temperatures again over the next several days. It's actually going to be fairly nice on Saturday and Sunday. Again, temperatures only in the mid to upper 70s and a few lower 80s in a few select locations. By next Monday and Tuesday, storm chances may return. It's a bit of a 50-50 chance right now. Weather will see scattered to widespread showers and storms or weather will just see maybe a couple of showers. And eventually by next Wednesday, temperatures return pretty much back to like really not what we should be this time of the year, but back into the mid-90s by Wednesday. Forecast is brought to you by Platinum Contracting. All dense repair in the dash. National Law Firm.